Just days after he appeared to float the idea of putting his political opponents in prison, former President Trump struck a different tone overnight on Fox News. When Biden goes out, everyone says bye bye, and then he gets indicted two days later and they go after him. The, the country doesn't want that. With a convention next month, Trump's so-called veep stakes is heating up. Sources say the campaign has formally requested vetting information from potential running mates, including North Dakota Governor Doug Burgum, Ohio Senator J.D. Vance, and Florida Senator Marco Rubio, who has clashed with Trump before. If he builds the wall the way he built Trump Towers, he'll be using illegal immigrant labor to do it. The <laughs> second... So cute. The... Such, such a cute sound bite. If Rubio is chosen as Trump's running mate, he may have to move out of Florida. That's because a provision in the Constitution potentially bars the president and VP from sharing the same home state. Meanwhile, a legal victory for Trump yesterday. We had a big thing happen in Georgia today. An appeals court has now halted the Georgia election interference case in order to resolve an appeal over an alleged conflict of interest involving DA Fonnie Willis stemming from her relationship with a special prosecutor. Christiane Cordero, ABC News, Washington.